Hallelujah, glory to God. Welcome to Purpose and Marital Bliss with Pastor Honoring. I have a prophetic word for someone. God says he is not going gaga. He is not going gaga. This word is coming to someone. You're going through a difficult patch in your life and you feel like God has forgotten about you. You feel like this is not what God promised you. You feel like God has God doesn't hear when you call on him. You feel like he has totally forgotten about you. God says I should share this word with you from the book of Isaiah chapter 46 and verse 10. He says God declares the end from the beginning. He says, and at the end of the day, his counsel will stand. His purpose will be fulfilled. His will over your life will come to pass. So God is not going gaga at the situation you're going through. He knows where he's taking you. So it doesn't matter the route you take to get there. God is there with you. Yes, Joseph, you are supposed to be a leader and your family will come bow before you. That is what God showed you. If God showed you that, if God told you that, then it doesn't matter whether you are in a deep pit, whether you are in Potiphar's house, whether you are in the prison. What matters is that God is with you and is taking you to that destination where he showed you from the beginning. God has the ability to bring to pass what he talks about. So God is not going gaga. He is not shocked you are now in prison. He is not losing his mind because Potiphar's wife is trying to frame you. He's not losing his mind because, because you have been thrown in the pit. God knows what he's doing. He tells us in Jeremiah chapter 29 and verse 11, the message translation says, I know what I'm doing. I have it all planned out. Plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you that future that you desire. He knows what he's doing. Yes, I know you've been in this place for long. You feel like it's been forever. He knows what he's doing. He has it all planned out. It's going to end up in praise. It's going to end up for your glory. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. God bless you. Shalom.